In the realm of interactions with public officials, instances of disrespectful conduct have been observed, particularly in confrontational situations. So you support Rick Adams? <laughs> yeah, fuck you! You support the guys in Palestine, they're homeless people all over New York! They yeah, you're always partying! You don't actually care about the citizens of New York! Why are you in Miami? You know there are people being arrested there, people are homeless in New York, people cannot afford food, you keep cutting the education money and budget so that you can fund the police! That's all you care about, funding the police! Everything is underfunded because of you! I'm trying to get this... Get holding the line. There exists substantial evidence suggesting that resorting to abusive language and launching personal attacks reflects a disregard for authority and violates established social conventions. It's imperative to emphasize the importance of engaging in constructive dialogue and maintaining a demeanor of respect even amidst disagreement. Moreover, the efficacy of confrontational strategies in effecting meaningful societal change is increasingly scrutinized. Such aggressive actions have the potential to isolate potential allies and erode the credibility of the underlying messages conveyed by protesters.